Okay then, today I'm going to be teaching you how to add Point Shop to your guys' mod server. So, first of all, all you want to do is go ahead and go in the link in the description, and it'll take you to this website. Just go scroll down a little bit, and you'll find the download for it. Just get the zip file, and once you've got that, you'll be take you'll be given a Point Shop WinRAR file or whatever you use to extract with. And all you want to do then is open up your server. Go into Gary's mod and add-ons. Yours might look a little bit similar to mine if you uh, have watched the previous videos. But all you want to do is in the WinRAR file, just drag and drop this points master into your server. Close that now, and that is basically done. You've got your point shop, uh, point shop on your server now, and people will be able to buy costumes and player models and trails and everything off your server. So go ahead into it. Go ahead into LUA and go ahead into sh underscore config and we'll take a quick look at this. I'll open it with Notepad++ and I'm going to go through a few little things in here just to go over it and help you out a little bit. First of all, you can go ahead and change the key that you use to actually open the point shop. So I usually use F4 just because... Uh, F3 is used for taunts on prop hunt, so it does get in the way a little bit. You can change the command that you use in the command prompt, or you can change the chat command. Um, you can notify people on join, so you can set this to false, or you can set it to true, and it'll just give a message saying, oh, press F4 to open the shop, uh, type in the console, PS underscore shop, or exclamation mark shop in the chat, just to open it up. Uh, how many times a minute's apart, so if you want it so that they get 10 points per 10 minutes, this is how what will happen. So, first of all, they'll get 10 points, and then they'll get 10 points in 10 minutes. So you can change this to whatever you want, 10 minutes, 100 minutes, 1 minute, whatever. Then, this is how many points you can be given after that time, so you can change this to however much you want. Uh, it, you, Everything is can be changed, so you can change the prices of things. So if you want everything to look expensive, so like a million points, you can just change this to like you earn a thousand every ten minutes. So change this bit to whatever you like. Uh, you can set that the admins can go to the tab, the app, the like, so they can give themselves points, or you can just change this to false, is what I usually do. And then just chain, keep the super admin as true, just so the people over the admin, so mainly like, if this is your server, this is most likely you, the super admin. You'll be able to give points, you'll be able to just give yourself everything without spending any points. Uh, you can just read through most of it as well, it's got a little comments next to it just to tell you what to do. Uh, we can also have the different names, so if yours is, like my personal server, I use cookies just because it's called crazy cookie server so they get cookies instead of points and it'll say oh you've earned 10 cookies after the 10 minutes they've been there you can also change this to name and price of everything what will be sorted out in categories and that is pretty much it I'll just go ahead into the server now and show you that it's working so I'll be back in a second another thing that I forgot to actually say uh, if you go ahead into the point shop, the LUA, items, this is all the things that will automatically be given to you. I usually delete weapons in it because it's not really useful in things like um, things like death run. It's not really that useful. Uh, it's okay in TTT that they can buy like, their weapons, but this can be changed for your own personal use. You can even put more weapons in if you like, but I personally delete that. You'll have trails power-ups, uh, some people delete the power-ups as well just because the super size is a bit overpowered, uh, the super small size is a bit overpowered, but everything else is pretty cool. Uh, I'll show you how to add platinum models, trails and all other things another time, so that will be no another video. So let's go ahead into the Gary's mod now and just check it out. So I'm back and all we're going to do now is just hit F4. And as you can see, we've got all the tabs of all uh, all the things. We've got player models, power ups, trails, hats, heads, and masks, accessories, and weapons. And we also have a admin tool, a, uh, admin tab. And what you can do from here is set cookies, give cookies, and take cookies. 
So remember I changed it to cookies earlier on in the video. This could say whatever you like. This could say tokens, points, just anything you want. You can also give players uh, items. So if you wanted to give yourself or someone else super small, you can. And you can also take the items away from other people. So that's been my tutorial on how to make add point shop to a Gary's Mod server. Uh, in the next videos, I'll be showing you how to add player models, power-ups, trails, and whatever. They might come as separate videos, so be sure to look out for those. And just leave a comment if there's anything in particular that you actually want. One thing that I was considering doing was showing you how to add your own personal maps. And just rate, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. See you again. If I die.